What's up, guys? We got a uh, bit of a mail call today, so uh, excuse the mess. We're in the living room today because uh, I don't have enough room in there in my uh, nerd room to open the box. So, got a nice Gundam pack or Gundam Planet package here. Go ahead and open it and see some upcoming builds. There we go. Just address already. Blocked. Ugh. I'll give them credit. Those guys know how to actually package some stuff. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Packing list. Yay. Now, I was hoping for some like very specific campaign parts and I don't know if I got them or not. So we'll see. Alright. Nope, did not get the ones I wanted. Dang it. Oh well, I've got more horse coming. <laughs> what are these anyways? Okay, so... It looks just like a big shoulder cannon realistically. I might could still use it, but... We got these campaign parts. I really need the big uh claw looking things. Alright, we've got the Hazel Custom, and of course if that's backwards, I'm sorry guys, I'll, I'll, I'll flip the video, hopefully I'll remember to do that when I edit. So, Hazel Custom, I thought I'd give me some Hazels, they look pretty cool, and you know me, I like big guns with my Gundams. Alright, and then for a group build that I'm working on, got the Goof Prototype from Mobile Suit Gundam Origin. I really dig the uh, the ability to replace the arms, and that's going to come in handy with the custom build I'm doing. So this will be pretty cool. I don't actually know who that pilot's supposed to be. I know nothing about this guy other than it's a really cool kit. So, and I will be doing the builds on these, uh, and also showing the custom custom builds as I go. Okay. see here. Hyper Gunpla Battle Weapons. There's a couple bits in here that I do need um, for said custom weaponry. So if you look here, these things that are like uh, scissors and not these things that are like scissors. A couple of these guns will be useful along with uh, some of the little cool armor bits might be useful. But uh, I can always find something to do with extra, extra weapons. Then, got the Goof R35 from Build Fighters. This is actually a really neat version of the Goof. I think it's based off of the revived version. Sorry about the sound in the background there. But I'm planning on using uh, some parts of this guy on that custom. So, um, I'll more than likely go ahead and build this just straight and then go from there. I do... I like the fact he does not have leg vents, that's, or leg hoses, that's pretty cool, so. If there are parts of this that will go on the uh, origin one, that's definitely what I'm going to do. Because I do like this guy, he's pretty sweet. Rambo Rao, he's so awesome. Mr. Rao. Okay. And last but not least, the advanced hazel. Like I said, I saw the Hazels and really kind of wanted to get into them. I know they're Titan suits, but I know nothing other than that. I'll probably do a little bit of research on it. These must have been re-released because this box looks absolutely brand new. And the fact that people have been uh, building them right and left again, so they must be new. I like these giant binders. They look like, I don't know what they look like. Just huge weapon systems. Honestly, that, the, the giant binder thingies, weapons, whatever you want to call them, that might actually help me out a lot in my custom build. This hazel, as it stands, might end up becoming a lot of my custom goof. That, that will be a very interesting custom. Now, just looking at the head on this guy, it reminds me a lot of uh, 
Reminds me a lot of um, Gujin Rebake. I like that. That's 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 neat. So, I right, guess that's it for the mail call. I do have a couple other things that I just happened to pick up today. I went shopping. Um, we're actually going on vacation um, this weekend. So, um, I did pick these things up from Toys R Us because I just had to have it. I have not done a Lego build in a quite some time. And uh, being the nerd I am, I saw this at Toys R Us and I could not pass it up. So there will be a build video of this. I'll do a cool time lapse. If you got, do you guys prefer a time lapse or would you like to actually see me build this in real time? Let, let me know what you think. I mean, time lapse is always fun. I, I really, I really dig time lapse stuff. Um, but if you really want to see me actually take the time to build it, that probably won't be too long. And also, since uh, since Wally, you know, I have my little desk Wally. I saw this. This this is just amazing. I didn't know this was a thing. So that is like a real semi-working Lego Wally. <laughs> I mean, look look at this thing. I mean, his chest opens up like it's supposed to. I doubt it'll spit out a cube, but that would be awesome. He comes with a little. Excuse me, comes with a little plant, his arms move, I'm pretty sure these tank treads are real, they will actually move. Uh, I'm just, I knew I had to have this guy, as soon as I saw it, so. Um, what else do I got? Give me a second, I'll be right back. Okay, so, to go with all that fun stuff, you guys know how much I like uh, Power Rangers. Well, at least old Power Rangers. I did find this guy today. Titano Megazord from, uh, or Titano Charge Megazord, I'm sorry, from uh, Dino Supercharge Power Rangers. Now, I didn't get this really from me. I got this just for anybody who needed it uh, in the uh, Power Rangers, Buyers, Traders, Sellers Facebook page. And uh, I believe a dude is buying it off me. You know, I, it, it's pretty cool, I'll be honest, but I have no true interest or investment in this series. But I knew that people are after it like crazy. So I went ahead and grabbed it just in case somebody really wanted it. Because there was only one. So, yeah. Um, so yeah, that's going to go to a new home very soon. Um, if you've seen the Japanese version of this, go check out um, MMPR... Toys or MMPR toy reviews or search Bruno and Mia if you haven't already looked at it Go look at the amazing video that they did with this and the other normal toys. It's ridiculous but the uh, the Japanese version of this is um, Ridiculous <laughs> it's got sounds it's bigger it's bu uh, bulkier the colors are better um, So kind of doing a mini review of this since I'm not going to actually get to review that, so. Um, I don't know why my thing just buzzed. Okay, um, another thing. I was at Walgreens earlier. And I've seen these before, but I got today, I went ahead and got them. My first real Funko Pops. Got a little Halloween Charlie Brown there. I just thought that was really cool. I grew up on the Peanuts stuff, and for, this is the 50th anniversary year of the, uh, the Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown. So uh, they're releasing a few of these things. And then of course, what's Charlie Brown without Snoopy? So you get a nice little aviator Snoopy there. Now I would kill to have the, uh, the doghouse. The doghouse would be amazing to have. Now they do have a couple other versions of these. Um, there's a Lucy dressed as a witch, but I would love to have this version right here, the ghost. I have not found it yet, but I'll keep looking. Um, I just, I just really like these. There's actually a Target has a Peanuts set that's, it's not Funko Pop, but it's all of the Peanuts characters. All of them. In one set for like 20 bucks. I'm probably gonna pick that up and get it just cause, you know, this is stuff I grew up on, guys. So, this is kinda it for the, <laughs> for Shoki's, uh, mail call slash, uh, whatever stuff I bought today. <laughs> Hold on, let me, let me squat my 
There we go. Sorry, the tripod is a little difficult sometimes, guys. Especially when I've got it in tall mode. I have a, uh, something of a transforming tripod here. There we go. It'll hold for about two seconds. And then, of course, hold on. Let me just get everything in one shot. <laughs> Blah. <laughs> and I do have tons more Gunpla coming, in fact, next week. Ah. So, um, we, luckily we're about to go on vacation because our house is a mess right now. So, that's going to be it for this, guys. Remember to like and subscribe. Stick around, see me build um, these things. And uh, I, I will enjoy reviewing these, especially because I know nothing about them. I love learning new things. And I love, <laughs> it's kind of funny to have people correct me in the, uh, in the comments. I actually kind of dig that. Um, but I'm going to try to research these uh, Hazel Gundams because I, I do like them. So, let's see, what is it anyways? RX-121. I already have no idea. <laughs> Alright guys, uh, I gotta go get back to a little bit of real life. I have a lot of packing to do. I hope you guys have a wonderful day and a great weekend. Um, I'm going to upload this video here really soon. So, I'll talk to you guys later.